Atlanta police are warning residents who use a popular taxi service after a woman's robbed in northeast Atlanta. Yeah, the victim used the online car service Uber, but a man posing as a fake driver took off with her cash. Our Natalie Pozo with News Radio 1067 spoke with the victim. Catherine Rossi was visiting Atlanta from Charleston. She spoke to us via Skype and said she'd used the Uber app for the first time the day of the robbery. Got the notification to um, that the driver was outside, and so when I went outside, there was a man who said that he was my driver. According to Uber's website, you can only use their services through their app. The GPS system picks up your location, and in return, you'll get a picture of your driver, phone number, make and model of the car. Uber says they take those measures to protect their clients. Rossi tells me she got in the car on Highland Avenue. A few minutes into the ride, the driver asked her if she wanted to smoke marijuana and pulled over into a motel parking lot and got off the car. Car. Rossi says because her phone was dead and she was unfamiliar with the area, she decided to stay in the car. The driver eventually took her to her destination on Edgewood Avenue and Boulevard Northeast, but the ride didn't end there. Oh, there are my friends. You can let me out right here. And he said, not until you give me all of your money. And I said, that's not how Uber works. Police say the driver would not let her out of the car and took off to a secluded location. She's not from Atlanta. She did not know where she was. She ended up giving him $40 in cash, and then he brought her back and dropped her off to the location that she requested. Rossi admits she should have paid closer attention to the Uber driver notifications and is glad all the driver took was her cash. Police continue to investigate. In Atlanta, Nathalie Pozo, News Radio 1067 for Fox 5 News.